Hi, this is Ayana Gregory, and you are watching In the Community. This is Naj, and you're watching In the Community TV. Hi, I'm Diane Moore, and you're watching In the Community. In the Community, yeah. Ladies and gentlemen, once again, it's your man, the homeless producer, Abdul Shaheed Munir, hitting three states. I mean, did you see me in South Carolina? You like that show? Killed it. Went to Reading, Pennsylvania. Killed it. Now we're in your community. That's what we talk about. Five states, a bunch of cities. So we got somebody very special to us. I know you sound like, well, you know, Shaheed, everybody's special to you. True, but we got one more special person. Miss Moore, she's been on the scene for a little bit. She's been away, took a little breather, but she's back. We caught her here tonight, blowing the roof off. All right, Miss Moore, how you doing today? Good, baby, I'm good. Peace. Now, um, you've been away for a little bit, you know what I'm saying? Get yourself together and whatnot. Welcome back, you know what I'm saying? Like everybody say, it's the time and place for everything, you know what I'm saying? So what brings you to I was attracted to the fact that they're trying to promote a music that is the foundation of a lot of today's music, you know, neo-soul, a lot of today's R&B, even house music, you know, hip-hop and stuff. The, the foundation for that comes from blues and jazz. So when they were trying to do something big to just promote it and keep it alive, I said, I need to be there. So. We are very blessed to have your voice. I mean, you seem like you didn't lose nothing. You still got it, all right? So, um, 48 hours. 48 hours of this jamming. Straight jazz, Dixieland, swing, you name it, ladies and gentlemen, they are planted here. Um, let me ask you a question. There is so much about jazz that's been going on that a lot of the next generation haven't experienced. What can you share with them and let them know like this is what we're doing and this is what some of the things that you may not do but be enlightened to? Well, first of all, I think that jazz is a feeling, okay? Just like back in the day when it started, you know, or which actually started way back in the day, like from Africa, but we ain't gonna go there, okay? But the point is, jazz is a feeling. So what I would say to the younger people is that even if you don't have the jazz training, still go with your feeling, because you'll still be carrying on jazz. But if you can, just try to do your homework, learn your history, you know, do your research, you know, just like you can download, download um, Alicia Keys and Neo and all of them on iTunes, try to download some classical jazz artists and you would be surprised at the similarities between what you love from those artists and what you love from today's artists. I mean she's really teaching us, that's what it's all about. I mean just teaching us. Each one teach one. <laughs> the next question, um people who are familiar with you and then we have the new viewers, give them a little history about who you are and um let's get them caught up. Okay. Um Music has been a part of my life since I could talk, which, you know, was like at nine months old. So I come from a musical family. Um, I've toured around the world. My first hit record was actually in house music with a group called Alcatraz. And I toured in London. I was on top of the pops. I was on MTV. And I toured in London, Japan, and around the United States doing dance music. So having done the whole house music circuit and the jazz house circuit, um, I, I, which 
forced me to be into which forced me to learn how to be independent learn how to produce I have my own music studio I've done two or three records that did really well out of my own studio and now I'm trying to I am moving out of dance music into neo soul jazz and the more um more of what's in my heart and soul, which is really more like jazz, neo-soul, and soul music. Is there other places, other venues that we could actually come and see you, let our viewers see you? Um, I just did an eight-month tour, four months in Singapore, four months in Dubai, rocking the house, jam bass in the house for everybody who knows about Jamaica and the top cities in Dubai. And now I'm back in New York, and I'm going to stay grounded for a while so I can finish my CD project get my album done on She Groovy Records, She Groovy Entertainment. Remember that. She and my band is the Groovy. She Groovy Entertainment. So in the next three or four months, look out for Diane Moore and the She Groovy Band. So if I were to talk about people that inspired me, um, of course there's the Soul Diva, Aretha Franklin, Gladys Knight, Eddie James. I love Nancy Wilson, love Regina Bell, and one of the biggest unsung heroes to me who I believe took her life because she didn't get the props she deserved would be Phyllis Hyman. Another big influence in my life who was definitely what you call a blue-eyed soul. She died at 35 of cancer. Eva Cassidy, that's my girl. God bless her. Rachel Farrell. Ah, um... NDRE, Jill Scott, people who come with a real message plus the talent, all of them inspire me. And of course, Stevie Wonder, come on, we can't forget Stevie, man. Stevie James Brown. Yes, I love Sharon Stone. I love Sharon Stone because she's a trooper. She's been in the business forever. People don't know it, but that original track with the sequence freaks, my name is Brenda, but they call me Blonde. I'm better known as the one and only. She was one of the original sequence freaks. People don't know that, and she doesn't admit it because she's going to tell her age, but baby, I don't care how old you are. I love you. But she's been in the business a long time, and she endured and followed her dream through all of these years, irrespective of what was going on. And that's why I respect her. That's why she's definitely one of my heroes as well. So, ladies and gentlemen, once again, your man, Abdul Shaheed Munir, in the community. Remember, no matter where you are, what community, what city, we will be there. Shaheed in the community. Hi, this is Ayana Gregory. And you are watching in the community.